I'm going to set up an RTL SDR dongle to be an ADS-B receiver so we can see information from planes such as their position, heading, and speed and that. And uh, before you do this though, we have to have the RTL set up on the, on the computer, the Raspberry Pi, whatever. And so if you do my other video, the RTL TCP server, that will do that for you. So if you do that first, you'll be able to compile this. There's no pre-made uh, install for this program that I've found. So you have to compile it yourself. But that's not hard. First of all, you download the software and the links in the information there. And once you've downloaded it, you'll have a file called master.zip. Just unzip that. Go into its directory, you'll see all a bunch of stuff. And just make it. Okay, if I run that now using the command dump1090, which is the frequency, uh, interactive, We'll start that up and you see stuff coming in. And it comes in a bit strange all over the place, but it gets there. Um, so what have we got? We've got altitude, speed heading, lat long, you can read. Uh, the time, now this is time since the last uh, message came in. And once that reaches 60 seconds, it drops that message off. Okay, usually there's a flight number here. So I'll just wait until one comes up. There we go. Now I have no idea what that flight number is, of course, but you can look that up and you go, oh, that's bloody going from there to there. All right, so that's all good and well, but if you have two SDR dongles, you can use another one to listen to the aircraft talking to the airport. Okay, so uh, we might do that now. There's an approach, good day, velocity 1230. 1230 approach, good day, sir, clear the zero one zero one. Copy that, just for information, it'll be probably uh, mid to late base before we clear the clouds. So it was, that was a Virgin flight number that he said, so we know where he is and what he's up to. And that's about that really. The antenna I'm using is a Discone antenna, which claims to be between 25 megahertz and 3 gig. Um, but it's an omnidirectional antenna, so it picks up in all directions uh, horizontally and it's just a general good wideband antenna.